Spokesperson for the city of Portland says that they have not yet received this lawsuit, but normally they do not comment on pending litigation. It was actually last month that the city council decided to delay the implementation of hazard pay until January of 2022. That's when the minimum wage is set to begin gradually increasing, which uh, would eventually reach $15 an hour. The hazard pay provision, which is uh, the central issue here, requires pay of time and a half during a declared state of emergency like we are in right now. The chamber says they're filing suit to seek relief and clarity on when that provision would take effect. While we bear no ill will towards the city, we cannot allow our member businesses, the majority of which are small and medium sized businesses and organizations to falter under the burden of what is now the highest minimum wage in the country. And People First Portland, the organization which initially put forth this proposal for hazard pay, they say that it should take effect immediately. We're going to hear from one of their volunteers coming up at 6 o'clock. But for now, reporting live in Portland, Terry Stackhouse, WMTW News 8.